Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. I am Cooligan Dragoon. In the last episode we got the Mass Immune. We took the Mass Immune to Frog. Frog refused to use it. We found the other piece of the Broken Mass Immune. It had Melchior in it. We took it to the Swordsmith Melchior. Melchior told us that he needed a Dreamstone, which hasn't existed in a long time. And then we took a portal to 65 million BC and our gate key got stolen. So now we need to look for the Reptites who stole our gate key, who are in the forest maze. Hmm. Kino, what you do? Say now! Ella, Kino take Chrono stuff. Why take? Kino like Ayla best. Ayla like Chrono. But Kino not like. Ayla, mellow out! Kino, you know why I punish? Kayla, Ayla no like Kino. No! Ayla like Kino best! No more do bad stuff! Okay? That wrong! Ayla. Sorry, Ayla. Sorry, Chrono. Give back stuff to Chrono. Alright, now say it. Yep, there you go. Now have Reptite Steak. Of course. Reptites, where they go? Run into trees. There. Ayla go too. Kino go back to village. Kino protect village when Ayla not there. Okay, Ayla. So, as you may guess, this is the forest maze. So, it's going to be fun. Kino is mad, so if Ayla die, Kino chief then. Ayla. Chase reptites, get back chrono stuff. So, you can see here we have footprints on the ground. Ooh, mid tonic. Alright. Let me down. Oh, wait, there, there. <laughs> Vines are confusing me. What was that? More birds! Prehistoric birds. So golden eaglets. Ayla does a lot of damage. Take him out, Chrono. It turned red. <laughs> there we go. 126. And a fort deck and a feather. So, as we also saw, if we get... Ooh, got a revive. If, depending on the items that we get, we can give them to the... Uh, we can give them back to the shop and get stuff from here. Hold on. How long does it take for you guys to come out? Alright, Ayla learned a new technique. Kiss. That. I'm gonna open this up. Mid tonic. Alright, there's nothing I can do down there. There's footprints going that way, but I wanna pick up this one. Mid ether. So, this is basically now just a game of follow the footprints. Ooh, what are you? Winged ape. What, did the Wicked Witch of the West send you after me? I'm kind of more surprised that you're still alive after dealing with both Chrono and Ayla's attack. And there you go. So I can't imagine you're going to survive too much after that. Alright, Chrono levels up. Chrono and Ayla are now the same level. Ayla was technically one level higher. Uh, come down here. Go over here and get this treasure chest. Get it. Get it. Get a revive. Oh, good. I need more revives after that last battle. Alright, and you? Alright, you give me a shelter. Oh, more guys. Alright, now they're down for the count. Alright, well where am I supposed to go to? Up over here? Follow the tracks, follow the tracks, follow the tracks. 
more runners. Alright, that are down. Meryl leveled up from that fight. Alright, where are the tracks at? I've lost the tracks. Oh no, there are tracks. But if the tracks are down there, then I want to go up here first to see if there's any treasure chest. Oh, but nope. But there are some gold inklets, so let's take them out. And they all bit the dust. Oh, there's some there are tracks everywhere. <laughs> Actually, I think these tracks just led me in a circle. Uh, yep. Uh, take me back uh, over here, and I can get this mid ether. It's like a long, out of the way way. Just to get that treasure. Alright, now we run all the way back around and we can go the other way. <laughs> Come on, Chrono. Alright, get this treasure chest. Mid tonic. Another winged ape. Eh, that shouldn't be too hard. Now. Okay, I take it back. That wasn't even all that hard. So, ooh, more treasure. And a heal. Okay. Uh, uh, down here. There we go. Can I go this way? Oh, that's a pain in the tuchus. <laughs> oh, well, it gave me what I wanted. So we made it through the forest maze all the way to the reptile lair. Go in. There we go. Ooh. Well, we are in the belly of the beast shelf. Oh, I wanted to look around and see if there was more treasure. But I, oh, see, I probably had a way to get to that one. I only need a way to go back up so I can go down. Oh, hold on. I gotta fight some of these guys. The evil weevils. That is a great name. I love it. <laughs> And you missed. That's right, Ayla, you just whip out that damage. <laughs> Take down some evil weevils. Is there a way I can go back up now, please? I think I went down the wrong hole. Can I go back up, please? Please, pretty please. Please put sugar on top. Aw, down the hole. My way around here. Nope, oh, but I do have to take you on it probably. So, what are you? Megasaur. That wasn't much damage. That was slightly more damage. You're getting iced. Why? Because I can. That was some nice damage. That was some very, very nice damage. All right, I'm going to use Aeolus technique, which is kiss. There you go, kiss Corona. Do it. Because it's a healing technique. I did not mean to make you do physical, Meryl. All right, Chrono hit. Ayla hit. You use ice on him. And with that silver earring, having her only have 50% of her magic cost is pretty useful. Take him out. Holy shnikes, how much health does this guy have? I've used ice on him twice. <laughs> Three times. There we go. Man, oh man, you had a lot of health. Let me through. I want to get over to other places. I think I picked a bad hole. Oh, now I assume I'm in the bottom. All these reptites running all over the place. I assume I go through here. 
Oh, and the winged ape. And, uh, ooh, shiitake. A little green mushroom down there. You should never have turned your back on me. Did you just throw your ally? You're throwing your ally at everybody. Usually he throws my allies at me. <laughs> this is a new one. If you die, you're going to die from a mushroom. That would be hilarious. All right, they're all down, but Harold's starting to get low. Fang, a pedal. Okay. Uh, I don't see any treasure down here. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get some healing. <laughs> oh, I actually did get around them. But not around this one. Alright, there we go. Oh, and a save point. That's gonna be... <laughs> if I ever know of a chance that this is probably going to be a bad thing. Alright, so everyone's getting maxed out, and we're gonna save this here. To this one. Alright, there we go. So, you know, I was asked one time what kind of is harder about in my opinion, about LPing, uh, what's this? Could those apes have made something this advanced? And, uh, what's one of the hardest things about LPing, uh, something like this? And it's most definitely the having to cut out battles, in my opinion. A sailor! Ah, the apes have arrived. Hmm. You are nothing like Aelas. Tell me, what is this is? At once! Uh, no. I guess you need some motivation. Come, Nisbel! Wow, this is only taking 20 minutes. Oh, then he, cores, he runs away. But we're in for a boss fight. All right, first, we're going to use some lightning, and you're going to use ice. Okay, lightning did jack. Defense power decreases when shocked. Note to self, lightning does jack, but is very useful. <laughs> but yeah, I think one of the hardest things for doing commentary on something like this is most definitely just like the, uh, the cutout. Especially for something like this where I have a lot of battles that I'm trying to cut out. <laughs> I'm gonna use lightning on you again. I'm gonna use ice on you. Because then there's just all these times where I'm trying to... Please don't do much damage. That did a lot more damage than I thought it would. Then there's a lot of times where I have just these battles I have to cut out. And so, for you guys, it's only, you know, like two seconds, but for me, nobody died, but for me, that's like two, <laughs> that's a couple, that's like 20 seconds or more, depending on what the fight is, so it gets to the point of being a little bit more ridiculous in just trying to overall, would you stop doing your area of effect damages? Trying to remember exactly what I was talking about. Lightning your face off. <laughs> I still need to use magic with Meryl. <laughs> but, that's why it's like, for something like when I did Dark Souls, when I did Legacy of Cain, it wasn't as big of a problem because... Oh, gosh. It wasn't as big of a problem because that was something where it was like, oh, okay, there's a cutscene every once in a while that was going to interrupt me. But that was usually about it. Or there was the, 
Oh, please don't die. Neither one of those two die. Okay, good. Because <laughs> outside of that, it was just a case if I could just keep talking and I didn't have to worry about too many cuts or interruptions. I need you to heal Chrono because I want to keep Chrono alive. Really, at this point, I just need to heal. Keep everybody's health up. There we go. And then when Chrono comes around again, I can use electricity and shock his face off. Which is a little bit... It, it's a clever tactic, but this is the annoying part. <laughs> is that... I have to do this, basically, to... Actually do damage against this guy. Because otherwise I'm doing, like, 15 damage. But then it gets to be annoying, because then he starts releasing that energy. Oh my good, I got a crit in. That'll help. Come on, just go down already. Just, just die, die. All right, we're going for the aura twirl as soon as Meryl's ready. There we go. And Ayla's gonna use kiss on herself to heal herself back up. And I was gonna jump. Ice you. That'll get Meryl back up, and I can start doing damage against Nisbel again. He needs some health back. Ice you, attack you, and attack you. That should be... Come on. Man, these bosses have a lot of health. There we go, Nisbel's down. Fall, Nisbel, fall into the darkness. 500 XP, 10 tech points, Chrono levels up, Ayla levels up. The apes beat Nisbel's. Give thing back to Chrono, now! But remember, we Reptites will rule the world. Actually, no you won't. <laughs> Your days are numbered. Is the gate key okay? Thank goodness, it looks alright. I fight any time, Azela. Ayla, no lose! <laughs> You leave Crano? No fun for Ayla. Thanks, Ayla. I learned a lot from you. Sorry, Crano. I try to be strong now, like just like Crano. Come again, Crano. Party, eat, dance, fight, fun. Come again. Yep. So we now. Mara and Lucia too. I need to get Robo back in the party at some point. <laughs> But I'm going to go ahead and end off the episode, guys. In the next episode, we'll be returning to the year 1000 with the red dream stone that we now have. And we'll be able to reforge the mass immune. So I will see you guys later. Thanks for watching and take care.